Hello Darts Nuts and welcome to Darts Review Channel. In this video I'm going to be reviewing a set from the Harrow's 2021 launch, another much requested barrel and these are the Harrow's Noble. So let's check them out. I'm reviewing the 23 gram version, the 90% tungsten and they're available in 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26 grams in steel tip and soft tip in 18, 20 and 22 grams and the retail for £47.95. So as you can see it comes in this cardboard packaging which is very neat and as usual Harrow's have got a nice picture on the back of the darts and a little bit on the dimensions and it tells you that it's a black titanium cotton and the front has got the predator grip which is from the harrow's predator which is one of my favorite barrels and recommended them to lots of people and on the rear it's got the what does that say ergonomic concave grip or scallop as we like to call it so if you push that little hole there pushes out this little cardboard tray and it's got a plastic section holding everything in place with a velvety covering on it and the barrels are fitted into a little point holder Look very nice with that kind of brownie titanium cotton and you've got a set of short super grip carbon stems and a set of the new Harrow's Noble small standard shape flights So the dad's fitted with a black coated point and it's a tapered scallop shaped barrel obviously as you can see it's got a fairly long front taper and that has the predator grip which is kind of like a pyramidal style grip and um, on the harrow's predator it was on the rear and obviously i'm a front gripper so i used the grip that was on the front which wasn't this one but now it's reversed so it'll be interesting to see how it's like for me and on the rear section you've got a very nice scallop part there so very comfortable for a rear grip and that's made of a thin uh, ring and groove grip then on the end it's a tapered section but it has got quite a bit of a lip there so if you're a rear gripper and you like to grip right on the end of the barrel you've still got something to push against but a very nice looking dart and that black and the brownie copper coloured cotton really looks nice and contrasting together but whether it's going to work for me as a fronty I don't know it feels as if it's more towards the rear we'll see and there's the super grip carbon stems and the new Harrow's uh, normal flights another nice design on them That's fitted with a 25mm black coated point. There's a smooth section at the front of 3.8mm and then you've got the section with the Predator style grip which is a, a ringed pyramidal grip. That's 18.2mm. Then you've got a section of normal thin rings and grooves of 4.2mm. On the rear it's a scallop section with the thin rings. That's 18mm and then on the end you've got a kind of an angled smooth section with a kind of a couple of thin rings that's 5.8mm. Length is 50mm, width is 7.2mm. <laughs> 23.06g 23.06g again And 23.06, so perfectly matched. And full setup, 24.87 grams. With nothing attached, the balance is just a little front of the center point. And with the supplied setup, it moves towards the rear. And this is the balance with medium in between short nylon stems and standard flights. You got a mix of grip here between medium and high medium so between 6 and 7 so overall I'd probably say 
I don't know whether you could say it's for front grippers but it certainly feels as if it could be well, obviously it depends if you like a tapered style barrel but one thing I've noticed is it feels very light to throw it's kind of strange really whether it's because it's nicely balanced or what I don't really know but it just has a very nice easy way to throw it um, the grip on the front section is what was copied from the uh, Harrow's Predator which was on the rear um, and it's kind of like a bumpy feeling grip not overly grippy but there's little edginess on the raised rings so try it around the middle on the middle it's um, kind of like a, a knuckle getting a lot more spin from the middle though but I have a feeling for grip it's mainly for front and rear grippers on that middle section although it's nicely balanced there it kind of feels as if it's rocking a little bit on my fingers obviously when you look at the dart it's got that uh, nice big rear scallop so you automatically think it's for rear grip but can't see why some front grippers won't be very happy with it and it's quite nicely balanced with the front uh, let's just try the rear section now it just feels very nice in the fingers that scallop though and it's a thin ring grip there but there's a little bit of edginess to the rings but also the fact it's in a scallop is kind of adding like a grip as well but really comfortable for the fingers to grip into the only thing is like I always say you need to make sure you release it nice and cleanly which my dodgy hand I can't always do <laughs> Uh, quite nicely balanced again from the rear but I think it's definitely slightly towards the middle where the balance is but probably not so great for a middle gripper gripping it there tried let's check out the ratings it's another nice looking barrel so I'll give it eight and grip overall 6.5 a little bit grippier on the front though weight match and quality both perfect so 10 and value it's pretty decent value so eight so that's the Harrow's Noble 23 gram like I said they feel lighter than what they should be but i can't see why it shouldn't work well for some front grippers and obviously definitely for rear grippers i'm not too sure for middle grippers though it, it's got a nice balance there but it doesn't feel like it's quite settled on your fingers if you're on that like knuckle part but on the rear very comfortable in the scallop and the front section if you're a front gripper that likes a taper it's got a decent amount of grip there so if that's what you like then you'll probably like them a lot but uh, another nice looking dart from Harrow's um, it's been another good range from them and 
obviously the the prices are not too bad either and that's always a nice thing to see keeping the prices as reasonable as possible and i'm sure that appeals to the customer so i'll leave you with the gallery and you can have a closer look at the darts and i'll see you on the next one happy darting